With the end of the year fast approaching and the seasonal slowdown on its way, I just wanted to give a heads up uh, in relation to cash flow planning around this time. Um, turnover sales tends to be in a different rhythm this time of year uh, and it can have an impact on your cash flow. Sometimes positively, but often it means that you've got more planning to put in place to make sure that uh, the wheels of the business continue to move. Um, Suppliers still chase for money. They want to clear their books before the end of the year. Uh, and it can be sometimes difficult to juggle everything together with wages and overheads. So what I suggest you do is actually take some time to have a look at your cash flow over the next few weeks and into January. Um, look at your age debtors or receivables and your age creditors and payables. Make sure they're up to date. If they're not up to date, then that's a different issue about the uh, the accuracy and timeliness of your accounts and key information, um, but that's for another time. Um, run through that, see what money's gonna come in, see what money's gonna go out, and plan it through. For those in recruitment, we find there can be specific uh, requirements for juggling the cash flow. Um, contractors need paying out before Christmas, and it may, may well be that if your invoices are not factored, you've got to chase them in even harder than normal. Um, for those that are factoring, that usually does smooth things out, but there can still be a mismatch between income and expenses as your uh, turnover can drop or increase uh, over the Christmas period. It's just a matter of taking that much care and thought over what's going on. Um, check you've got enough uh, money in the bank or facilities uh, and make plans if you're going to be running short. It's always better to um, ask for further funds in advance of when you need them. There's le less pressure on the banks and there's more time to do it, you will get a better rate. So even though there's still two or three weeks to go, uh, it's best to take action on this now. When you look at the figures, if it turns out you do need more finance, um, often the first place is the bank, but it's difficult to get um, comparative figures. Uh, here at Davis Grant, we've got access to a, a funding platform that cuts across 100, 120 different lenders. And we'd be more than happy to see what we can do from you, for you. Some of the uh, lending can be quite innovative uh, and really isn't what's on offer in the high street. So that's my advice. Take action now. Check out your um, cash flow over the next few months through December and January and make sure that you've really got all the finance you need in place. If you need more help, as always, please do get in touch.